चिमेला आई ओ राइट ओह शुक्र है मास्टर जी आप लोग आ गए मुझे यहाँ से बचाने के लिए इनको समझा तो सही जरा जी वो रिश्ता है यार शुक्र है मास्टर जी आप लोग को बचाने के लिए in english oh excuse me please she's saying that she's very glad that we are coming to help her escape <laughs> like ask her what she stole are we kya chura tha aapne lo ji churana kya tha maine wahan risale ke upar likha hua tha ke mufat mein hai free to maine utha liya ab ye log kehte hain ki tune chori ki hai well nothing she must have said more than that yes please she's saying that she took a book from the newspaper shop but the book was free well there's obviously been some misunderstanding i'll i'll sort it out with the police Will they be sending her to prison? No, 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 no. Uh, nothing as drastic as that. I'll have a word with the sergeant. Uh, five pounds ought to do it. Ah, I'm understanding. That is a fine. No, no, no. It's not exactly a fine. Uh, let's just say it's a little gift. Gift? Yes. It's an old English custom. I scratch your back, you scratch mine. Ah. <laughs> you scratch my back, I scratch yours. That's right. Very well. What are you being itchy? No, no, no. Sure. Come on. Good evening. Good evening. Are you Mr. Brown? No, he's Mr. Brown. I was speaking to him. <laughs> yeah, this is your right first time. Who are you? Ali Nadim. No, I am Ali Nadim. You are Mr. Brown. Yes, <laughs> Ali. I'll do the talking. All right, you just leave it to me. Now, I'm sure we can sort this out, Inspector. The Commissioner looks after promotions, yes, sir. Yes. Well, uh, you look like an inspector. I'm sure it's only a matter of time. May I compliment you on your station and what a wonderful job you're doing? Thank you, sir. Now about this young lady. Ah. Yes, I... thank you, sir. Yes. Now about this young lady. Ah, yes, I expect you'd uh, like to have a look at my driving license. What for? Well, to verify my identity. You said you were Mr. Brown. Yes, but you want some proof, don't you? Look, if you tell me you're Mr. Brown, I accept that as the truth. Yes, but I could have been lying. Were you lying? And uh, no, he's uh, definitely Mr. Brown. He's telling the truth. And he... <laughs> I insist you look at my driving license. Oh, very well, if it'll make you happy. Is this yours, sir? Pardon? This five-pound note. It was inside your driving license. Are you sure? It could have dropped out of your trouser pocket. Oh yes, and dropped upwards, I suppose, onto the desk. <laughs> oh, you might have had it tucked up your sleeve. Yes, and I could have a couple of doves up the other, but I haven't. It was definitely in your license. Yes, Sergeant is correct. I remember you putting it there not a moment ago. <laughs> I forgot. It was just before you said you scratch my back and I scratch yours. Thank you, George Washington. No, I am Ali. Yes, Ali, just just be quiet, please. Now, Sergeant, about this young lady. Yes, the accused. Yes, well, remember British justice. I mean, a person is presumed innocent until proven guilty, and this poor lady is innocent. I know that. I mean, just because she's an immigrant, you can't go picking. Up... Pardon? Oh, she pinched the book, all right, but she thought it was bakshi. See what it says on the front cover. But free inside, colour supplement. That's right. Oh, and she thought the whole thing was free. Yes. Ah, well then it's not her fault. If anyone's to blame, it's the person who's been teaching her English. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> it's not always easy. Well, if that's all, we'll be getting along. Come along, Jamila. <sighs> oh, but I tell them, Master. Uh, before you go, sir. Would you like to make a donation to our police charity fund? Yes. Well, you've caught me at a rather an awkward moment. What about the fiver? You remember, sir? The one you thought you never had. Oh, that fiver. You know what they say, sir? What you've never had, you never miss. <laughs> Unless, of course, you knew it was there all the time. In which case, it would come under bribery and corruption. <laughs> you scratch my back, and I'll scratch yours. <laughs> I didn't think you would. Well, well, well. Regular little fagin, aren't you? I can explain, Sergeant. You're not going to show me your driving license again, are you? No. That's a relief. You see, we were actually trying to return the goods. I mean, ask the students. She's a girl. Why are you? Now look here, Sergeant. It was obviously just a misunderstanding, and I see no reason why you should pursue this any further. I'm sorry, Madam. Miss, if you don't mind. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm afraid I shall have to make a report out on this affair. Oh no! Couldn't you just forget it ever happened? No. Well, I'm sure your police charity fund wouldn't say no to another contribution, Sergeant. Well, we're always grateful for anything, sir. Uh, shall we say uh, another five pounds? That's very generous of you. Yeah, right. Right. Come along, everybody. Just a moment, Mr. Brown. Where are you going? I've not made out my report yet. Yeah, but I've. I've just given you five pounds to uh, forgive it. Oh, no, sir. You very kindly donated five pounds to our charity fund. It wasn't meant as a bribe, was it, sir? 
No. Good. Now let's take a few names. You, madam. Sorry. Ms. Cockney. Thank you. You, sir. See? Si. What's your name? Por favor. <laughs> How do you spell that? <laughs> That's not his name. Oh, giving me a false name, eh? Por favor. I'll come back to you, Mr. Por favor, or whatever your name is. <laughs> you. Yes, please. What is your name? Oh, no. What is not my name? I don't want to know what your name is not. What is your name? And I'm telling you it is not. You. What is his name? Nine. Aha. Uh -huh. Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Mr. Nine. That is not his name. You just said it was. You ask me if his name is Vot and I tell you Nine. Vot is not his name, but also not Nine. I'm going around the fence. What is his name? Absolutely not. Not what? That is correct. <laughs> what is your name? Wrong again. He's not here. Who's not here? What? <laughs> now, who is not here and what is not here neither? You're all balmy. Mr. Brown, if I promise not to proceed with this report, will you do me a favour? Yes, what is it? Get these crackpots out of here <laughs> and promise never to bring them back, even if they've committed murder. 